So I can just go to Katy Perry's official site that uses WordPress and add slash WP dash admin. And now I could try to log into her admin dashboard. This is a security issue. In this video, I'll show you how to hide your WordPress login page or basically the admin login, but you'll be able to change it to any URL you want. With punch. <laughs> Hello, internet people. My name is Robert, and let's start by going to the WordPress dashboard. In here, all you have to do is go to plugins, add new, and in the search box, type WPS. And as a first result, you should see WPS hide login. This is the plugin we want. Now, keep in mind that some other plugins have similar functionalities. If you have a security plugin already installed, then you might have already this. But in any case, let's install this one and then activate it. Once it's active, just scroll down to your settings and here you see WPS, where is it here? Hide login. We click on it. This is where you have the settings. Now you can change this to anything you want. So for example, let's say you want it to be dashboard. So it's not so easy to find out. And in the redirection URL field, you can specify what page is shown if someone tries to access the default WP-login page. Then you can change it here and save the changes. Now, make sure you remember what you're typing in here. So let's do that. Save changes. All right, and it's save it now. So let me log out. And if I go to WP-login, you can see there's no such a page. Also, if I go to admin, no such a page. So I have to go to dashboard. So slash dashboard like that. And you see now I can log in. Let's go back in. So now your website is a tiny bit safer. However, to improve your site security and make it airtight, check out this tutorial where I'll show you my favorite security plugins for WordPress.